coming up on this episode of All Access. We're going to Paris. The plane is amazing. I know French, but I will now be a translator. What's up with young player? My boy DJ. Okay, okay. okay. I'm about to do some interview crashing today. Let me give you the mic. Who gave him this? Who gave him this? A little bit off camera right here. A little bit off camera, man. Yeah. Oh. About that time, you know, a little overdue. Will you marry me? Playing in a new environment, that electric atmosphere. DeRozan on the draw! Wee wee! Parle vous français! We're going to Paris. Play is amazing. He's looking to create memories and have fun with my teammates and family members. Oh, wee wee. We're going to Paris. Excited to go. Look at these two guys. Kobe White's back there. I over here. Bonsoir tout le monde. On est en route pour Paris. A bientôt. Sit next to my little baby, man. Excited, you gotta stop saying that, dog. You gotta stop. Going to Paris. He gonna learn some French and eat some French fries. Bonjour. <laughs>
Thank you. Thank you. It was my first NBA game and I, I was starting, playing 38 minutes a game. Special moment for me and my girl, you know, future wife. The Eiffel Tower about four months ago. Just Much colder. Right, now we're still just as scenic. It wasn't sunny the last time we were here, so it's nice to see it, you know, in the light. It gives it a nice little, uh, nice shimmer. Give me my boy DT in Paris. He did it big. They should have never brought me to Paris, dogs. We did it, dogs. Yeah, we did it. We did it. We did it. Yeah. Yeah. Now, I love history, so looking around, seeing the buildings, obviously the Eiffel Tower, seeing all the, you know, the history, architect, it's, it's beautiful. I love wine, it's no better place to be, obviously, with Burgundy and Bordeaux around, so I'm having a great time. You know, it's, it's fun, even walking walking the streets yesterday, fans coming up to you, being excited, saying that, that they're going to be at the game. You know, it's, it's, it's a humbling experience because it shows you how, how big the the game of basketball is. Some people show up when the lights turn on, you know. <laughs> Come back, Jack. Oh. Let's go. Ben. Ben, no. Beyond. Beyond. What you got? Ready? Thumbs down, right to the pocket, right to the, right to the pocket. Oh, yeah. Nice, good finish. Good test. Doesn't matter. Great finish. I hope. Jump in, jump in, jump in, jump in, jump in. It's nice, huh? Ah, ah. Fundamentally sound, fundamentally sound. Hit me with a crossover between the legs. Nice. Just sharing the love of the game. Just the more you can get involved at a young age, the better it is. Kobe did a great job today. He was my uh, assistant. And he was really on the vibes, just making sure that everybody had good energy. Oh, yeah. oh, come back. Oh, oh. oh, yeah, go, yeah, go, yeah. Show, show, show. You gotta pay attention, Cole. Hey, y'all, it's DT. We're here in Paris, and I'm about to do some interview crashing today. Y'all see Zach Levine. Here we go. Shopping, looking at the site, drinking wine, and. Oh, excuse me, Zach. Excuse me, Zach. I have a question. I have a question. Um, you know, I just got here. Good answer. Good question. You know, we're in um, Paris. Have you ever been here before? Nah, I've never been to Paris, bro. Oh, okay, okay. Yeah. Hey, get, get your son. Get your son. Hey, hey, get your son. Hey, hey, hey. Go put him in time. Hey, go put him in timeout. Come on. Ah! Want me to sit right here? Want me to sit down? I'm going to put you in timeout. I've never seen you do your own bun. Um, who, do, who, do, who does your bun for you? Devo, get your guy, Devo. Who does your bun for you? Get him, Devo. Get him. <laughs> Who gave her the mic? Kobe White. <laughs> Can you do a little shake for me? A little, yeah, yeah, that. Um, what is your infatuation with them calling you Booch instead of Nicola? The only reason why is because in the U.S. everybody was butchering my name. Thank you, Boo, um, for appreciate your interview, it. and I appreciate it. You're not bad it. at this. Has Patrick Williams ever been seen in jeans? <laughs> Find a picture of me and jeans is very rare. So what's your infatuation with your different hairstyles? Because over the years, I know that you've had different uh, hairstyles. And so this is my more relaxed look. This is like my three days no shave look. Side step. Side step. There we go. Oh. 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 hating today. Oh, I'm running out of energy. When you're a competitor, it's kind of like that natural feel of 
you know, especially playing in a new environment, when you have that electric atmosphere, you just go out there and compete a little bit more. You had an extra step, extra juice. You know, this is a definitely a privilege to be playing in Paris. Um, and you definitely want to leave a lasting impression for sure. This is my first time seeing it. Uh, I've seen like pictures and video of the space. For equipment, we just made sure we had extras of everything. A lot of guys needing sweats and t-shirts and accessories on this trip. Try to make it, uh, you know, as presentable as possible for the guys. It's an honor from one Morgan Park alumni to another to hang this jersey up in Paris. We've come a long way from the south side of Chicago, my brother. Chicago Bulls. It's just another road game, baby. It's all business. We're just here to get a win. What an experience that this is for the Chicago Bulls and the Detroit Pistons to have the opportunity to come to Paris, France, a place that the Bulls haven't played since 1997. What an incredible opportunity tonight. Well, the NBA's done a great job bringing both these teams over and then really putting on a great show for the last four days. I think the fans here in France are in for a special treat. I think you're going to see two good teams going against each other. Should be a really good basketball game. DeRozan on the track! Oh! Welcome back to DeRozan! Oh! Wee wee! Parle vous français! Here is Williams! Oh! Patrick Williams! It's great for people here in Paris to get an up-close look at, uh, at the NBA. It makes you realize that the sport is followed so closely around the world. It was, it was a great, great venue and a great experience. The Bulls brand globally, can you comment on that? When I look at our data, you know, because you see it in terms of our website and our app, you know, the Bulls are top five around the world. This team continues to be a huge attraction everywhere we go. Zach Levine, all the way! Oh, watch your head. Hanging in the loop! Oh, wee oui, wee. Oui. Being out here has been great. My family's been here. We've been doing things as a group. The culture, the fans, obviously, the environment, you know, it was electric. Oh, go get it. Oh! I know for me, I'm going to look back years, years down the line and realize how great of a moment this was. It definitely was a beautiful atmosphere and, and, and you know, it definitely was a privilege being able to be a part of this whole thing. And we can fly home safely, Chicago. Bulls win! Bulls win! Bulls win! Here in Paris. Woo! Love Paris. Can't wait to come back. We we baby. Yeah, can't wait. To we come we back. baby. What's up, Bulls fans? Thanks for watching this video. For more, click here.